Hey YouTubers, I'm gonna make a video on the app that I actually used to make this vid video called ScreenFlow. And ScreenFlow is a desktop recording application that records your screen. And you can also put in also the eyesight or your camera and other images or other videos. So here's the basic layout you get. You get all the sources that it gets in. You get the microphone and the screen. Um, play, rewind, box, uh, fast forward. Now here's where you get your customizing from. The video properties. So if I click on a video source, which is my desktop, I can zoom in to it, zoom out, let's go back to 100, 102, whatever. Um, you can change the rotation. I don't know why I want to do that. I mean, oh, it's actually pretty cool. You change like the axes, change how th like the opacity. Want to make it like see through or something if something's behind it. Reflections, shadow, and add video action. So. So you're done recording and you want to focus on that picture right there, the BP. So this is what you do. You zoom in. Get it so that the BP is only visible. And you press add video action. And now, look. And now it's going to stay like that unless you make another video action, which can go back to the regular one and then you have to move it back and then you add video action so let's go to the beginning and see how it plays so there you go and then if you want to make this longer just like that it makes it longer okay I'm going to delete those delete delete and for the next you get audio properties, you can make the audio louder or not loud, and mute the audio, add the audio action which makes it louder or not. See, none of these effects will happen unless you add the action. Now this is, okay, so here's one, let's go back to 100. Ever wanted to you're showing where you're clicking and you want to emphasize where you click so let's go find a part where I click okay I'll click right right here so now I add an effect which is the radar and then add that so let's see See that little circle that came out? That's that's the radar. So whenever you click, that comes up. Now I don't use this. It it's call out. It like highlights where the cursor is. But I don't use it because whenever I do it, it crashes. This it just all it does is highlight. It like zooms into where the mouse is and like if you want to emphasize where the mouse is. Now there's the media, the screen recording, and the what I talked. So if I add a recording of video or something I can just press that or add media so I want to add a picture add that and then just drag it into here and if I want to make it longer just make it as long as a video and what it does is you can move it to any part to, of the screen if you want if you want to make it a watermark you just well, not, you can't do that now but you just go to this. Let's go to this. And now let's change the opacity. So now it's kind of see through. And that's it. And um, you have saving it as just a screen flow thing, which won't take up as much space. Make a new one open. Split the clip. And it's like all these actions and everything and now here's the part if you want to upload it to YouTube or if you want to make it like just upload it to YouTube or anything you have to export it and you export it as you can make it HD which by going to customize size making it 
HD that, and then press OK, and then pressing OK. I won't do that now. But once it does, a little bar comes up right here, and it exports it to where you choose. And mine's the desktop, and that's it. It makes the video. So thanks for watching. This is just an intro to ScreenFlow.